necessary steps. If we put in the hard work, then the Williamson County Democrats will be an underdog worth betting on. If we close the gap and elect Democrats locally, we can make a Williamson County where all voices are heard. I challenge all of you to join the fight to turn this county into a better place for all of its people. If you want to elect representatives from a party that will fight for all of us, then we've got work to do. If you want representation that will strengthen welcome families by increasing school funding, by putting the trust of teaching back into the hands of our teachers, and by expanding Medicaid, then we've got work to do. If you want to see real justice because you believe that all people, regardless of race, gender, sexual orientation, or age, deserve to be treated equally, then we've got work to do. If you want to build an economic opportunity for all families, and if you are fed up with a Republican majority that supports a poverty wage instead of a living wage, then we've got work to do. If you believe that women should have autonomy over their own bodies, then we've got work to do. If you are like me and are fed up with the Republican Party's failures, and if you are ready to kick them out of office, then we've got work to do. If you are ready for change, then we must be committed to the number one objective of this organization, and that is to elect Democrats locally. We must elect Democrats like Mike Clark, who will fight for a path to citizenship for all. Democrats like Judy Jennings, who will support our teachers and our students. <laughs> Democrats like Paul Gordon, who will fight to expand Medicaid in Texas. <laughs> Democrats like Anthony Rector and Terry Cook, who will finally restore two-party representation to the Commissioner's Court. And we must elect progressive Democrats for our school boards and our city councils. If you are ready for change, then ladies and gentlemen, we've got work to do. Change will not come easily, but if we put in the hard work, change will come to Williamson County. Now I want to tell the 300 of you what you can do to help us close this gap, and let's elect Democrats locally. You can help by attending our fundraising events to ensure that we have the necessary funds to run aggressive grassroots campaigns. You can help by becoming a safe, sustaining donor to support our community operations. You can serve on our party committees, join your local party clubs, volunteer with your candidates, make phone calls, knock on doors, and help your precinct chairs organize in your community. If you don't have a precinct chair, then now is the time to step up and become one. Our president said, in the face of impossible odds, people who love their country can change it. Yes, we have a hard road ahead of us in Williamson County, but if we are focused and committed to change, I believe that there is nothing that we can't accomplish. If we are united, if we work for change, then the Republicans of Williamson County won't know what hit them.